good morning guys uh, today we will uh, do the second program of this lecture series uh, in this program we will uh, try to uh, make the program uh, with which we will be able to find uh, the maximum of two numbers so let's not waste much of the time and directly come on to the programming part so let's say that I am naming the folder as max dot pl okay yeah okay so so I have to find the maximum of two numbers so I'll uh, take the definition with the two um, uninstantiated uh, variables for um, for now and uh, then I'll see whether they both are equal if let's say they both are equal then I will okay let me do some sort of indentation part okay then I'll uh, simply write that they both are equal both are equal and uh, I will uh, simply write the this portion okay mm. and again if x is greater than y okay if x is greater than y then I'll write suppose let's say I've taken another variable z then I'll uh, instantiate z with x the value of x and I'll write print the value of z on console so again like this okay this is else part hmm. and uh, I'll again if let's say y is greater than x then I'll instantiate the value of z with y and I'll again print it on my console. So write y. Okay, I think. Uh, hmm. So write y. So I think uh, this might work. Let's see what will happen. So in order to run my uh, max.pl file. Uh, prolog program I'll have to first compile it so max dot pl and uh, remember after every statement uh, we'll have to use the period sign in order to indicate that the statement has terminated okay there is no problem no error and uh, the compiler has read nine lines here okay I think that uh, huh that's right uh, the compiler has read nine lines so I'll directly call my definition function definition part suppose that I have to see which of the uh, uh, two numbers five and seven which of them is bigger so let's say oh yeah seven is bigger that's right if again I have to see minus one and minus two again minus one is uh, yeah that's bigger okay I've done something uh, some mistake uh, let's start okay yeah then again max minus 1 and again minus 2 because I've done uh, some mistake previously I want to see it again minus 1 was there okay and uh, now we'll press semicolon just to tell the compiler that there is uh, that uh, we don't want to uh, stop here we just want to see uh, the other variable as well so I think uh, uh, I'll take another example 1.9 and 2 let's see yeah 2 is bigger so the the code is quite effectively working uh, well and uh, I think I should uh, change uh, the code and make it look a little bit you know uh, uh, good so I'll uh, add the parenthesis so that uh, it becomes more understandable and more easy to grasp so okay oh. we can use these parentheses whenever we want to and uh, I think um, Instead of uh, comma in this place, we can also use this symbol. 
they both are same uh, i have at least uh, uh, seen them whenever i have used them uh, they both function uh, in the same way so <coughs> so let's again run it and see whether it's working or not no let's see where the error is 14 11 and 15 2 14 11 okay 11 okay i've written oh, oh i've written this thing why and 11 11 2 let's again run it 14 11 and 15 2 Okay, unexpected error or hmm. Let's wait for a minute and see where I made a mistake. Mm. Okay, I think I made this some mistake here. No. Uh, let's run it again. No oh, and the sixteen two. Oh, I think now we should, uh, ah, so I haven't added uh, the period as I've uh, previously told you all that uh, we should uh, never forget to add the period after every statement in order to indicate that yes, we have terminated our statements. So now let's again run it and see whether it's working or not. Okay, let's say 7 comma 9. Yeah, it's working. Max minus 1 comma minus two so i hope okay uh, previously when i have a, when when i didn't use uh, the brackets uh, in the previous uh, 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 without using the brackets uh, previously uh, there was a mistake uh, which was uh, encountered so uh, when i have written uh, when i when i has written the statement max minus one comma minus two it was showing minus one and it was again asking from the user whether to show the another output also or not so if we'll press uh, semicolon then it will show the other output it will not press semicolon or will press uh, let's say period then it will not show the output another output so that was a mistake so after using the parenthesis and uh, correcting my z at this place instead of y it's working properly so let's run it final time for uh, Okay, seven nine nine and uh, two point seven nine eight. I hope it should work well. Seven nine eight uh, nine 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 nine. Maximum of two numbers. I think it's working uh, correct, but uh, due to certain reasons, I even don't know why it's uh, showing this. Uh, uh, I think it's not taking the absolute value it's taking uh, the relative value so we'll see uh, we'll see this in our next video uh, how to resolve this problem and uh, I hope that I'll come up with a solution in the next uh, video on how to solve this particular thing so thank you guys for watching this video and please subscribe if you liked it and uh, do comment if you have any problem. I'll try my level best to solve your problems. Thank you very much.